Alright, let's have a look at the YouTube comments. Where are the funny intros at? Funny intro? I ain't got I ain't got nothing prepared. Funny intro, funny intro, what is funny, what is funny, what is funny? Oh what is funny, what is funny? Ah, nee. Ah, nee, okay. Ten thousand coins, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There's Oh I already did that. I already did that. I already done that before. What could be funny? What could be funny? Oh no, no 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 I cannot do that, I cannot do that. Funny, different, what's funny, what's different? Mm-hmm. Foot Champions is nice. Oh, um, That's all I got. I ain't a comedian, alright? I ain't a comedian. Anyway, guess who's back ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video on this channel. In this video ladies and gentlemen I'm going to show you a fantastic way to make coins fast on FIFA 21 Ultimate Team which is not sniping. Finally did it guys, I finally got a video without sniping filters. What we've got right here is actually something that you can use either on the web app, companion app, you can just use it if you do not really like sniping. Anyone can use it, it's very easy to do and you will get some nice profit. Anyway, something that I should mention is that we have hit 4,000 subscribers. We've hit it yesterday and we are now at 4,150 subscribers. We're going on a train, yo. We're going to... It's the Polar Express, man. It's going hella fast, yo. It's the Harry Potter train across the bridge, yo. I mean, we're going so incredibly fast. It is unreal. It is absolutely unreal. Our goal is to hit 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Man, we can even reach it. We might even reach it at the end of this month if we continue like this. So if you are one of the 89% that are not subscribed to this YouTube channel but you do want to see the best trading methods and the best sniper filters, make sure to click that subscribe button right now. And also guys, can we reach 150 likes for today's video? That would be insane if we can reach that. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, without any more further ado, I think this is a short intro. I think this is a short intro. Alright, congrats to myself, let's jump right into this video. Today ladies and gentlemen, it is all about ways to make money, to make coins in FIFA 21 using silvers. Now guys, do not sleep on the silver plays because they are phenomenally good and you can make a lot, a lot of coins from these methods. For example, right, I'm just gonna search up quality silver and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the Premier League, right? Let's have a look and see what the cheapest one up on the market is. Let's go to 600. There are none up on the market for 600. 700. 700 is the cheapest one. Right here we've got one for 500. We've got one 550. We've got Murphy for 700. We've got this dude here for 700 as well. Why are silvers selling for this much? Because of certain objectives that you have to do. You have to use a silver team to get a rare mega pack. You can get that special Vidra as well. So if you want to get this Vidra card, all you need to do is to win two matches in the Life and Fat Friendly Silver Lounge, score five and assist four, and you can get yourself that Vidra card. So silvers are kind of popular right now, right? And especially also with certain SBCs where you need like seven silver plays. I am telling you guys, silver cards are the way to go right now in FIFA 21. Do not sleep on all of these silver methods guys. It's, it's working phenomenally well. You can open silver packs if you want. I've made tons of profit just by opening, sitting there, opening silver packs that are worth 2.5 thousand coins and eventually I got myself like 5 thousand coins, maybe 4 thousand coins profit from these packs. So for real man, do not click off this video, it is it's guaranteed money right here. But also in case you did not know this, let's go to silver team of the week and let's have a look and see what the cheapest one up on the market is right now. And we're gonna go for forwards because again you do need this for the uh, objective. Now the cheapest one right here is Matt, about 22 thousand coins. Did you know, did you know that this guy was going for 22,000 coins? In case you have him in your team, you just packed him or whatever, sell him right now. Sell him straight away because you are going to make a lot of coins. When the objective is over, this dude might drop to maybe 9,000 coins. So sell him while you can, sell him while you can. Let's have a look at any silver team of the week players. Let's have a look right here. 14, 16, 19, nope, it is the exact same price 21,000 coins for Matt right here so again if you have them sell them straight away sell them straight away let's have a look and see what 
silver team of the week players are up. We've got this dude right here, Sarabert. We've got Grant. We've got Matt. And I do think those are the only options. We've got three players right here, three silver dudes that you can pick up right now. Now, of course, you can snipe in this uh, with this method. You can just snipe a few players right here. So cheapest one is 20,000 coins, right? Let's go to 18 and you can go ahead and try and snipe these ones, right? Now this is a silver method that you could use and I mean you could snipe plays, you can bid on plays, you could just check for yourself, see what sells, see how much they are going for. Let's, I mean the chemistry style with the hunter one, there are a few right here for 23, this is the cheapest one with a hunter card. That is actually pretty cheap if you ask me, hold up, okay. So. I didn't buy this one unfortunately, but I could have made myself like 7,000 coins and he was already up for a few minutes So that is a way you could just do it's not really sniping because not a lot of people are using this method right here So check this one every now and then see if there's a good deal up uh, up on the market that you can pick up right now now for example ladies and gentlemen with the hunter chemistry style on the players they are going for about 22, 23. Prices are different. Prices are different. We've got one player over right here. His name is Grant with a Hunter Chemistry style right here. The rest are all mats. All mats, all mats. Now let's have a look and see what the next cheapest Grant is. We've got one right here for 28,000 coins. This dude for 22,750. I'm going to pick him up. I'm going to sell him on for 28,000 coins as well. And this wasn't even sniping because he was already up for about 8 minutes or something like that. So you know what, I'm going to try and sell him off for 27k. I will be making myself 4,000 coins profit right here by just selling this dude. And when he will sell. It might take a few realists. You know, I might have to lower his price a little bit, maybe even by 500 or 1,000 coins. Eventually he will sell right now while it is still active. This wasn't even sniping because he was already up up on the market for a few minutes. But another silver method for you to use right here is the following. Go quality, go to silver, obviously. Go league, go for example, go to, go to the Bundesliga right here. Now first up, let's have a look and see what the cheapest one up on the market is. I think that these ones are kinda cheaper to be honest. 400 coins, let's have a look, 400 coins. We've got this goalkeeper right here, 400 coins. We've got this goalkeeper right here, 400 coins. These ones don't really sell because as you can see, there's one up right here for 550, which ain't a lot because they are goalkeepers. So what I like to do is put chemistry style to basic and go and, and go ahead and have a look at, for example, 500. And as you can see, there are plenty more up on the market right here. Let's go to 450. Let's have a look at 450. Let's see what we got. Let's just have a look, All right? I'm just going to have a look. So we've got a few players, 350 coins. There wasn't even a snipe, Nielsen. There wasn't even a snipe. We've got him right here. Is that a duplicate? No, that isn't actually a duplicate. All right, let's have a look and see how much he's going for. About a thousand. My man is going for about a thousand coins. You know what? I'm going to sell him on for 950 right there, making me 600 coins profit right here. It's that easy. It wasn't a snipe. I was just checking. I was just checking the market. And that's all you have to do with this method. Just check the market. See who are up, which players are up. This dude right here, Pedersen, 900, 750, 850, 600, okay, okay, that ain't a lot. So you know what, I'm gonna place a bid on, 300 coins. You can also do this with another league. Let's go to Premier League, let's, te let's test that one out. And again, this is not a method where you, all you have to do is snipe, bro, and just focus on sniping. No, man, you can just check a few prices between the methods, you know. For example, this one right here, let's have a look. Cheapest one up on the market from the Premier League. It's way more expensive, 800 coins. There we go, Elliot right here, Liverpool player, 1.3, 1.3, he's got a bit, 1.1, is he still up? No, dang, I'm just about to buy that one. We got this right here, 800 coins, let's have a look, see how much he's going for, 1.4 right there, 1.1, I could potentially buy him, no, I'm gonna buy him, and I know I will sell this card on for 1.1 thousand coins, let me do that, let me do that, 1.1 right here, 300 coins profit, just like that. What about you, O'Shea? 1,000 coins, 1,000 coins was the cheapest one. Again, I'm gonna do the same one right here. There's another one popped up right here. Justin, what about you? How much are you going for? Look, it looks like the same, 1,000, 
1,000 coins, hey, you know what? I'm just chilling here. And you know what? I'm just gonna buy this card, whatever. And I'm gonna sell them on for both for 1.1 thousand coins. I'm not going for the min list, guys. I'm not going for the min list, because why should I? Why should I go ahead and sell them on for maybe 950? That will make me like 100 coins profit. That ain't a lot. 850, there are plenty more uh, cards, right? There are 350 coins. Man, if you're lucky, you can get this card right here. That would be an insane buy, not gonna lie. That would be insane. And again, you don't have to do this for the Premier League. You can go to the uh, Italian League as well. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's see what we can get. Cheapest one is around 550. Yeah, it is a little bit cheaper. It is a little bit cheaper. And hey, if you do not sell these cards, guys, you can also just keep them. Keep them in your team. 88 pays for this dude right here. Hold up. Is he still up? Yo, I'm gonna buy him. I'm gonna buy him. You, you, bro, that is an insane card to use in the um, in the objectives. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at the price for 700 right here. Okay, seven minutes though. 700. You know what? I'm gonna list him for 800. Doubling my coins. 400 coins profit right here. Easy as that. All right. So my camera just went off. That was a kind of shame. But I managed to pick up this dude right here, Villian with a catalyst for 500 coins. That is actually really cheap. Now I think I could sell them on for maybe 950 coins and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. You can go through all the, uh, what's it called, all the uh, chemistry styles as well. Let's have a look at Hunter and see what the cheapest one is. There's one dude right here, Plata for 1.8, dang. He doesn't play in that great of a league, no offense, he doesn't have that great of a nation, no offense still, but you know what, I'm gonna pass on this one and again, you don't have to snipe these players, you can just check the prices. For example, a card with a hunter from Austria, from the Australian, again, no offense. But it's not the greatest league and it's not the greatest nation. So is that really worth it? In my opinion, absolutely not. If you can get one maybe from the Premier League or the England League 2 with a French nation, whatever. And he's being listed up for maybe 1.4, 1.2. Man, that's worth it. Buy that card, sell that card on, especially right now, of course, because of that SB. See, oh no, the objective, because of the objective. Let's have a look at shadow cards as well. Are they as popular? They could be, they could be. 1.6, 1.8, oh no. 2.5? 2.5 is cheap as well. Hey man, I mean, that's a lot, not gonna lie. Well, what about catalyst midfielders? What about those? There are plenty more up on the market right here. Cheapest one is around 1.5. 1.5 is cheapest one. 1,000 right here. Doesn't play in that great of a league, no offense, still. But for example, this dude, if this Kafu card was the same price as this one for 1,000 coins, man, I would buy that card straight away. Same for this dude right here. Same for this card, same for this card as well. Same for Saga as well. There are just plenty of options to trade with silver players. Now, if you guys do wanna see another video explaining how to trade with silvers, how to make more coins, how to make more profits, more methods, then let me know in the comment section down below. But for now, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If so, make sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Take care, peace, and bye-bye.